It's my birthday. Don't I look happy? <laughs> Sitting in the parking lot of a Drury Inn, drinking a free Dunkin' coffee because the guy, sweet, sweet man, inside the thing said, Oh my gosh, are you okay? And then gave me a free drink. Can you explain to me, some doctor or nurse or something, explain to me why you don't give narcotics to kids? Is there no pain relief when you give narcotics to kids? Does it just like fly through their system and they don't get any pain relief? Because I can tell you that that's false. I have given my older son pain meds after surgeries. My younger son had tonsils and adenoids out last week. It's been a week. I sent a message like, guys, we're struggling here. It's been a week. We haven't slept. He won't take medicine when he's in pain and I can't keep in front of it. So during the day, I'm doing constantly every three hours, Advil, Tylenol, Advil, Tylenol, Advil, Tylenol. Guess what? He has a really crappy GI system and so he throws up a lot when he doesn't have anything in his system. And guess what? He doesn't have anything in his system because he can't eat because he can't swallow because it hurts. So I sent a message today. Hey, is there anything else we can do at night? I know we're in the like five to eight day window where the, the scabs come out and it's going to really hurt. It's been a struggle. Is there anything that we can have for the next couple of days to get us through this? Just like one or two doses at night? No, unfortunately, there's nothing other than Motrin and Advil we can give you. If you don't feel like his pain is being properly subsided, then take him to the ER and he can be evaluated for uncontrollable pain. Do you know what I say to that? Fuck all the way off. You would rather, instead of just giving me one or two doses of fucking narcotics to get him to be able to sleep through the night because I promise you he's not going to become a heroin fucking addict at four years old. You would rather me spend $1,500 going to the fucking ER so I can complain to them that he's not in controlled pain and then they can tell me that they can't give him narcotics either because they're not his fucking doctor. Get it fucking together.